Brad Biznet here with Cole Publishing, and I'm chatting with Josh from Hammerhead. Josh, how are you doing today? Doing very well. Good. I'm pretty excited about what we're going to take a look at here. We're going to take a look at the Hydra Slitter, correct? Correct. Which is a new product for you guys, new product on the market. Brand Tell new. me a little bit about yeah, it. Yeah, brand new. We launched this in August, and this product was really designed, it really stemmed from, if everybody remembers the Flint, Michigan water crisis. I do, yeah. The lead services were poisoning people, making people sick, causing all kinds of health issues, and we learned that there's still 10 roughly 10 million active services in the United States running and feeding people water today. Wow, okay. And lately, municipalities have been helping front the money to get that problem solved. And so we designed a slitter kit to actually get that lead service uh, decommissioned and install a new pipe to supply fresh water. Excellent. So you identified a problem or recognized the problem right away. Like, let's give people a solution right off the bat instead of waiting a year to do so. Yeah, absolutely. Unfortunately, we started down the wrong path in the beginning because okay. originally we thought we had to remove the lead from the ground because we kept hearing remove the lead, remove the lead. Sure. And it turned out we tried dragging it out and doing different things, but it's difficult to do that because it's so soft and malleable. It does it, it has no strength. Okay. So we finally learned that it actually just has to be removed from service. So then we could go back to our roots of pipe bursting. I was just going to say, it kind of sounds like something you guys know about. Correct. Anybody can burst pipe. We've been doing it for years. Sure. So we identified that if we make a special custom blade, really sharp little blade, and we cut that lead, it takes such little force to cut it that the lead doesn't bunch up on sure, us. Sure, that makes, okay, that makes sense. And then we can just open it up with our expander and our tooling and pull brand new pipe in the same spot. So this is the Hydra Slitter setup here? This is the actual tooling string that you would use. Okay. We have two different kits. We have one strictly for half inch, which is like 1% or less of the market. Okay. And then we have another kit that has five eighths, three quarter, and one inch, all in one big kit. It comes with everything you see here, a, a router, custom cable. This cable is quarter inch swage cable that's then brazed to a 3 eighths cable. So you push the small diameter through first because it's hard to get it through. Okay. Then you have a cable to pull the bigger cable into the pipe because you need the bigger cable pulling strength to get that kind of work done. Okay. And then this kit has everything you need plus replacement parts. All right, so what we're seeing here is this our standard kit for our 5 eighths, 3 quarter, and 1 inch uh, tooling kit. We put this all in one toolbox, so everything you need is there, and hands, and everything for your replacement parts are listed up here. So here's our three quarter inch blade. If you were to drop this and everything falls on the ground, you can simply just match it up. Everything there is to scale, so you can find the replacement parts you need. Um, there's extra parts for everything that you're gonna be doing, and on the flip side of this card, you'll see the actual matrix of the part numbers you need based on the work. So if you're doing half inch work to three quarter, use these part numbers. Here's the pictures of how it, the tooling strings go together and all your part numbers are on this side. So one kit, everything you need, keeps it nice and tidy. What other equipment am I gonna need to put this into action? Generally, the backhoe that you use, backhoe or mini X that you use to dig the pits, sure. is exactly what you use. So you attach this to the cable and use your backhoe to pull this into the ground. Essentially, anyone who's gonna attempt to do this kind of work already has the equipment They, they to put will into have play. the equipment already. Okay. The only time it might be uh, different is if you were in a real shallow ground, um, maybe in Florida where the water services are really shallow. Um, however, most of those are newer houses okay. and, don't, and lead wasn't used because it likely. really stopped using about the 1960s. Okay, this has been great, Josh. Where can somebody go for more information? Uh, the best place to do is you can go to our Hammerhead Trenches website or you can go to hammerheadshop.com and buy them right there. Thanks for introducing us to the Hydra Slitter. Thank you, appreciate it.